What's up guys? Welcome back to another reaction to The Boys and today we are reacting to the season 1 finale. We are finally here. It is episode 8 titled You Found Me. So yes, we are finally at the season finale of the season. I did not I did not really anticipate the glare from the window there of the light. It's not well, it's not really that bad, but like if I move there you can see the the glare of the light, but whatever, my apologies. It's a window there. Can't do much about it. Yeah, I don't know why I'm out of breath by doing that. Anyway, so, yeah, like I said, we're on the season one finale. I'm um, very excited to see where this goes down. It's like, a lot of stuff's been happening. It's like, I just don't really know what to expect with this final episode of the season. So, like, a bunch of crazy stuff's going to go down. So, of course, last episode now, of course, all our main characters, like, all the the boys, that that crew of characters, their families are all, now all in protective, protective custody. Uh, the police are involved now. No, the CIA, FBI, it's one of those. <laughs> My memory is shit on some of these things. Uh, they're now involved. They're trying to take down Vaught. They're telling Madeline, yeah, stop this crap or we'll expose you guys. Uh, there's now a... They learn that the terrorists have a soup, a guy, a, a super-powered person in their hands, which is not good. And, uh... What else happened? Like, oh, crap. What else happened last episode? Uh... Shoot. Oh, yeah, right. Huey, uh, Starlight now found out about Huey, that he killed Translucent, and that Huey also told her about, you know, the... the the, at birth, they turn people into supers and stuff. It's not natural. It's like they force that on people and such. And she's not quite happy with Huey. And they're they're kind of at an uncertain point now. I'm not sure what's going to happen to them. Like, are they going to be good after this? I mean, like, I mean, also, the, the Billy did shoot her with a gun. Didn't, she didn't kill her. Like, she was thinking of her because she's a super, but still. Yeah, definitely, definitely a rocky situation for him and her right now. Because also just, like, fully became a, a couple. But now, like, it's... Not looking good for him on that end, so, uh, yeah. I'm trying to think of what else. Yeah, also, the, uh, the Seven are, are now all aware on this stuff, what's happening with Huey and the boys and such. A-Train's now pissed at Huey for indirectly causing him to kill his, him, Popclaw and such, which he's still the, the bigger ass because he killed Popclaw. Uh, like, and, but still, I guess, like, you can see what he's trying to mean. Like, you made me kill her by putting in that situation, but still, he's still a bad dude by doing that, A-Train. Uh, you know, the Deep's really down low now. He's just, like, just, like, not having a good time now. Uh, he's, like, living in a shitty apartment and such. And also, like, girls are, like, also, like, I guess, raping him also now. Or, uh, we'll see Homelander starting to take more charge in this situation. Uh, we also learn, we also learn about, I almost forgot, we learned more about Rebecca, uh, Billy's wife, who she, of course, like, like we saw, the, the Homelander raped her. And, but she, he impregnated her also with, her, with his child. Which then killed her because it was a super baby, which they thought couldn't happen that he could get someone pregnant, but he did. And by the birth of the child killed uh, Rebecca, and the child also didn't make it, so... Yeah, and we see, you know, this person, Mallory, come Mallory, we learn, we see who Mallory is, we don't, we still don't really know much about her. She comes to Billy and then offers him a, her, him a job with her to, you know, take down the soups and all that stuff. Uh, just a bunch of, a bunch of stuff happened, it's crazy... Honestly, um, so I definitely think we might, my prediction is for this episode at least, so what I think is going to happen, we're going to at least, we'll probably see another flashback with Billy, with Mallory, and meeting Frenchie and, and Mother's Milk, uh, learning more about their like, job stuff, uh, I, I feel like, like, Starlight might join up with Huey, or like, sort of side with them a little bit, I don't know, because I remember like, when I did the reaction to the last episode, the thumbnail for the next one showed her with Huey in a scene, so possibly she makes, they make good at some point, possibly, I don't know. Uh, I also have a strong feeling that Madeline might get killed by Homelander, I don't, I know, I, I don't know, I just feel like she might die, like, I feel like she's, like, like, Homelander's currently in a situation for, like, uh, she might die, I could be wrong, but I feel like that could happen, I, I've been kind of suspecting that she might die, uh, she, she just feels like she's that, yeah, she feels like she's in that position a bit where she, that could happen, I don't know, so... Uh, yeah, it's very interesting. A lot of stuff going down. Uh, like, definitely, I don't, I don't really know what's going to happen, honestly. It's very interesting, because we, we have season two after this, so, yeah. No, nothing, like, foolproof is going to stick in place. They, they can't, they're not going to fully take down the seven or bot. So, yeah, without further ado in my recording, I am yep, I am, good. All right, so, without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's get into the season one finale of The Boys, shall we? Yes. Tower Rifat Syria. 
This this is the place right where they saw the terrorist with that that explosive guy, right? Okay, I got this. Oh, and uh, you guys, you are the real heroes. <laughs> yeah, he's gonna. Sorry to keep adjusting the camera there. I'm just like not wasn't happy how he was sitting. I look at them making their meth. Gentlemen. Oh, jeez. Aha, whoa. Oh, this is about to be a slaughter. Why would you keep... Oh, oh my god. Jeez. Oh, whoa, wait. Those, those people are... True. Oh, jeez. I can't tell if those last few people were like, were they trying to... Run for their life? Were they not? Were they innocent? I don't know. Oh no, he's gonna. Ah. Uh. Oh, oh my God. Just the sound of it. Uh. Oh my God. Now this. The Islamic State is not exactly hey, hey, Jim Beaver. scientific. He's Bobby on Supernatural. Nice. How did they get the formula? Oh, wait. Huh. Honestly, we have no idea. Oh, you must have some idea. Some tourist shoplift it from your lab. Oh, okay. I thought. I, Maybe an inside job. I first thought they were planning it there to make it seem like, we oh, like we didn't to make to this stuff. This as much as you would. But no, they don't know. If I had my way. The Justice Department would haul your smug, tennis-toned ass into Congress and make you testify to corporate fraud. Because of the Nakeeb asshole that is out there, we have to keep Vaught happy now. Vaught are the ones that fucking created the cut. We have no solid proof on that. No uh, proof? I fucking will rescue the proof from a basement. Interesting. There's, their plan's gone to hell a bit now, the whole situation now with Common V and those guys. Fugitives. Bart insisted, and, and the DOJ agreed. You're wanted men now. Oh no! Oh, please! They're wanted now. This ain't good. They finally thought they had everything good, like they were winning. But now, oh man, everything's gone to shit. I'm gonna also go back to that first scene once I'm done watching the episode. I kind of missed part of the opening dialogue there. I was talking. I was about to say like Jim Beaver because. Uh, I gave you the Eric Kripke made Supernatural and he made this show, so that's like and cool, like, trusted you. like this is a fucking thing. Bring him in. We're on the verge of nailing these cunts. Are you? And you want to cut bait and run before we play the final card? Kind of what is right it now? Hmm. Does she know about it? How old was I? Hmm? Oh, does she actually know about How old was I when you let Vought pump me full of drugs? Annie, honestly, I don't know what How you're old? When you let them turn me into a freak. You're not a freak. Never say that. Does she know about... Oh, boy. So it's true. Yo, man. <laughs> wow. The mom wanted this? Like, for her, I guess? Like, she... How much did... You made me think that I was chosen by God. You were! God brought Vaught into our lives. He made this possible. Bullshit! <laughs> yeah. You did! This was our dream. This was your dream. Yeah, I never geez. got a chance to choose my own dream. She, no wonder I don't sucks. know where the fuck I'm supposed to be. My mom just sucks. Like, my God. He agreed to all of it. And then one day, he... He didn't. So he walked out on us. So he didn't fully agree with Maybe he didn't want to lie to me. So I'm the monster. Uh, you have a good life. <gasps> No, people you, you would kind give of are. anything to be what you. See that the dad's more Annie, Annie, is, the, is the better one Annie, situation. Annie, this kind of the one that said also this is for me advice. at the uh, at the benefit thing. <laughs> when do I ship out? Oh, <laughs> you're Gosh. not getting shipped out. And you're not. So much. Leaving. What? Thanks. I don't know, his life's kind of just done, basically. That's what you get for being an ass, and, like, something happens, man. Where, are they at the place that doctor is? is? No, that's not, is that the doctor? No, it's not. Who is, 
Oh, it's Mallory, isn't it? Yeah, it's Mallory. Alright. Doesn't sound like they end on great terms. Something seemed like something happened, it seemed like. Or is he just saying that because he owes her still about revenge on Homelander? I don't know. Is her vocal cord starting to heal? Is that what's happening to her? Or is she starting... Because is she able to talk or is like is her thing, her vocal cord's damaged? That's the whole thing. She was trying to like, speak there. I won't go. Oh shit. Run! Run! She heard that before they did. Oh, oh no, the cop wrapped them. Oh jeez. Oh no. Just give her like, trank. Yeah, oh uh, no. No, they're, Ah oh, shoot. They got him. They didn't see her going underneath the, the car? Okay. Okay, I'm about to say it, like, that you guys are that dumb and you're going into the car? There's simply nothing else to say. All right. I help you. They have a, what shall we say, a very special relationship. Complicated, intimate. Oh, uh, yeah. Hard to quantify. Complicated, indeed. So. Still have a few fingers and a few pies. I don't know if Homelander has a weakness, but if he does, she'll know it. Vengeance isn't a path to glory, Hugh. It's a one-way ticket to a dead end. Interest. She was all in for doing this before, but now she's not. She's telling Huey that don't get... Try, no, go ahead. Try to tell him to get out what he can. Do people recognize him out of this suit? Because people don't, don't recognize Starlight out of the suit, so like... But none of them wear masks, because they should recognize him. Yeah, like about to say, like, people should recognize him. All he wears is just, like, visor. That's funny. Um, it really looks like you're only keeping an eye on me. You know I'm A-Train, right? Yeah. And I'm Homelander. You're back to A-Train. Oh, uh, listen, I'm sorry about that. Now that you know I'm A-Train, now we're good? What? Listen, no, no, I'm sorry. It was my mistake. Yeah, you're damn right it's your mistake. Oh, I just realized what. I'm A-Train. I'm the fastest fucking man alive. Wait, I just realized. Was he watching as him because he's black? What are you all fucking looking at? Was that why he was watching him? Oh, that's not. That's bad. He's got a okay. bunch of fake license okay, plates. What are, we, what are we gonna do? How are we gonna get the guys back? We're on our own. We gotta get to Stillwell before the walls close. Who gives a fuck about Stillwell? We have to go back for them. You don't get it, Huey. Becca comes back from the dead. Robin, too. This is never gonna stop. It's just gonna be more blood and awfulness. That's the fucking game. If you don't like to play, why did you join the fucking team? Didn't it, honestly, not me. You didn't really join. You kind of like almost not forced anymore. to do it a little bit. And the whole translucent situation happened. You're a fucking pathetic cunt. And an insult to Robin's memory. Oh, boy. The team's breaking apart a bit. But what's Huey gonna do? He can't survive on his own. He's wanted. Like, he, he kind of needs Billy. He can't just... Be on his own. I don't. I don't really know what's gonna happen. What's happening right now at this point? The team's broken up. Such. Oh, here we found her. How's this gonna go? Like she's. I feel like she's kind of. Where is she kind of mad? I don't know. I mean, why the hell would I ever help you? Because Vod's up to some evil shit. Because it's your job. Because you're a superhero. Really? You got a point there, a bit. I can't remember the last time I saved anyone. You saved me. I was, I was angry after Robin. I was headed for this cliff, and then you and me went bowling. It's not saving you. That's you saved a mess. Just being there. And yeah, it's the more metaphorical sense saving. <laughs> I, I'm just, you're, I'm just gonna. <clears throat> you're about to destroy your whole career with his piano skills right now. I'm trying to wonder, I want, from what he was implying, it's like, are Vought giving compound beats to the terrorists, or did they make it themselves? Ah, uh, I don't know. I feel like they probably gave it to them somehow, like, on the down low, so that, wait, is that, is that who I think it is? Mr. Edgar. Yeah, it is. I, uh, I didn't know you were going to come. Let me borrow you. Oh, that, that's who Edgar is. 
I one time saw a photo of like uh, him with, with Carl Urban on the show. I thought it was a fan made thing, but I guess he actually is on the show. Man, Gene, Gene Carl Esposito just loves playing like villain type characters. <laughs> She's happy now. Like he's like Breaking Bad, Mandalorian, the boys. I really did break every bone in my right arm. What? Stopping the bus from falling? You said the marketing guys made it up. Be the annoying goody two shoes asshole that you are. One of us has to be. Damn. And she's making a point she's not like the rest of them. Like she does genuinely care and stuff. Pretty fucking incredible coincidence. He's implying she did have something to do with it. Okay. It's almost like... All right. He's starting to be actually... Me. Oh, wait. He did? Me. Well, I thought it was... I made him. What do you mean, you made him? I thought I was going to say she did it. I borrowed some Compound V. I had a train run it all over the globe. And I supercharged some jihadis. Oh, okay. <laughs> Say something. He think he's thinking she would like this, but I don't think she does that he did this. Or does she like that he did? I don't know. This relationship is weird as hell. The pain of losing a child to miscarriage is... I just wanted to spare you that burden. Uh, I don't like that face he's making. Let's see. So I'm back to the hotel. I'm not telling you. The hell did what did he just do? Is that something in his mouth or something? What's his plan exactly? Oh wait, this does he have like a a secret bomb in his or some kind something in his mouth that's gonna help him get out? I managed to poly grip in my twelfth grade retainer. See? Felt it looked like a permanent bridge, and it totally worked. Shit. Ranger, you could pick a lock with anything, right? There's premium metal wire in this thing. Come on, Okay, one second. Retainer. Come on, man, spit that bitch out. Oh, oh, yeah. Shh, stuck. Okay, okay, stand still. Wait, what? Stand still. Open. What? Open the mouth. Uh, mm. Come on, get up in there, French. Mm. Just go deeper, just a little deeper. Yeah, do... All right, all right, all right. Stop all right, your right, tongue. Right, 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 I'm doing that. Man, I'm gonna knock that bitch out your mouth. Okay. What? We're not at that step yet. We it's, don't have to do that. It's, all, it's, it's just gonna sting a little bit. All right. Sting. On three. One to three. Okay, well, if you count down. <laughs> oh, you all right? Let's go. Let's go, boys. Time to let the boys loose. I've been searching for her cunt's weakness. He doesn't have any weakness. No. There isn't a weapon on Earth that they haven't thrown at him. They've all failed. But that's not what I'm talking about. He's talking about you. I'm talking about you. Yep. Me? Whoa, what the? Wait, what just happened? Where'd that blood come from? Where'd that blood come from? What the hell? Oh, it's from Frenchie. Oh boy. I'm about to say, like, he didn't die there, did he? Oh. <laughs> he shot him right in the head. Shit, it's out. It's out. What do I do? It's out already? Reload. What the fuck do I know about reloading? Yeah, why didn't you just do it, Crunchy? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hands on your heads. It's gonna happen. Oh, we're gonna starlight the rescue. Yeah, I knew she was gonna probably join them up, help them out. They're caution now. She's about to mess them all up. <laughs> this was her Thor entrance. She saved the day last minute. You came. Like you said, I'm a fucking superhero. I'm the only good superhero also. Everyone else is a dick. Well, not Queen Maeve. She's good. Everyone else, screw them. <laughs> Holy shit. A-Train. Oh, he's on his compound B. He's not thinking straight. Homelander was right. He 
You are a fucking rat. How is this gonna go down? And you're See, A Train could just go up and grab him in any second right now, though. I mean, he can't, his leg's not healed. Someone's up, yeah, because he could just run out of any second. Oh no, he's, he seems fine to run then, I guess. That's a nice shot there. I didn't kill her. Yeah, you did. Oh wait, he's not. No. I did. Oh, okay. No, he's, he's not, is he not going to do anything? But it was your fault. Oh. No, he doesn't have the strength to actually do it. Oh no, it's a compound V getting to him. Oh. What's happening? No. It's definitely a compound. Oh, he's having a heart attack or something. Wait, is he just. Whoa, just dead like that? Oh, fuck. No, no, yeah, he can't leave him to die. He's not, not like that. Two, three, call an ambulance. He'll never stop coming for you. I know. That, that's, that's some great character progression. He wanted to see a train, like, get what's coming to him. You have to go. I'll take over. But now he Huey. doesn't want him to die. Or else you'll get caught. What an a train, though. Won't he just then tell the others about Starlight? Oh, boy. He's got to just load her of C4. Man, he's gonna... He's making a scene. Uh, here comes Homelander. I got him. What is he doing? I got him. That's his leverage, because I don't... I don't think Billy can kill a kid. Um, he's not that... Billy Butcher. You don't mind if I call you Billy, right? It's got the bullshit, huh? You know that we, uh... Bro, it's not my fault. Okay? She came on to me. It happened. Will you stop? You know, it's, it's the fame. They got crushes. There's nothing I can you do about it. piece of shit. But what I will tell you is, she was a hell of a lay. <laughs> oh, she came three times, eh? Three times. Oh, All right, Shut little man, up, dude. Light now. You think I'm responsible for her death, don't you? So now, you have a hostage that, that I care about. So, what's your plan? You gonna tell him about the baby thing? I'm just gonna hurt you. I mean, really fucking hurt you. Are you telling me that this whole thing is based on fucking feelings? <laughs> on a hunch? Can you please take him upstairs? It, man. Hold on. Uh, take him upstairs! Shut the fuck up! Oh, what's gonna happen in the scene? What on earth is about to happen? You promised me. Fucking promised me, and I managed to squeeze the truth out of him. The real truth. Wait, there that wasn't the real truth? Yes. That's it. There's some wait, what? There's more? Wait, was there wait, so what happened? Like what I'm scared. Did did his that baby actually live? I'm scared of you. Like what? Oh boy. What is going to happen? Oh. Jeez! He's shocked, like, oh, that's brutal. Now Billy's got no card to play now. What's going to happen then? Like, it's, it's going to let him go or something? What was that plan again? Yeah, what is the plan? Oh, well. What? 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 What happened? Well, he's not dead, obviously. Homeland is definitely not dead. Is, like, Malin's kid dead, maybe? Wait, what? Wakey, wakey. He got, hey, buddy. he got him out of there just in time. Up for quite a while. Time to get up. Come on, you're gonna love this. Come on. What is going on? Mom? Wow. Is that Rebecca? This handsome devil. Is that his kid? What? You know who else? No. Father. I'm an 
we are a family. Uh. <laughs> That's it? That's how it ends? It's the first seat. What the shit? Pause it. Okay, that was season one of the boys. Like, what the... That is not how I thought that was going to end. Like, okay, most of my predictions were right. Like, actually, all my predictions I said at the start of this video came true. Starlight was going to... I mean, she didn't join them fully, but she did help them out. I knew I knew that was going to happen. I was, I was right about that. I knew... I mean, we, we, didn't see any, we didn't see any new Mallory flashbacks, but we did see Mallory again, so... There's that. And Madeline died, I figured that. I even had a feeling that Homeland was going to probably kill her just based off stuff in the last episode, but... It's still shocking, honestly. I didn't, I didn't not really expect them to actually kill... Like, him actually kill her. It's really surprising. Uh, that ending, though, what the... I was not... Honestly, not expecting that, so... So she's been alive all this time with Homelander's kid. Like... What does it mean going forward now? Because now... Because now Billy has no actual reason to go after... I mean, he still raped her, but, like, a lot of his major grief, because he, he th thought he killed her, but now half his whole reason for going after her is now completely shot out the window, so, like, that was going to happen now, like, is he still going to try and take them down? Like, we, like, we know, I mean, he must be, I don't know, we know the others are, because they're, they're going to try and take him down for all the Compound V ship, like, what the, I don't know what's going to happen now, this is crazy, ugh. There's so many other things going on right now. Like, okay, so A Train's aware of Starlight's betrayal, like, or of helping them out, but also she he tr she saved him or tr made sure he stayed alive. So, like, is he gonna be on? Cause I don't know what's going on with A Train. Cause the thing is, like, he admits that Huey, no, he did kill his girlfriend Pakla, but like, he he's the reason he had to kill her. So, I wonder is he gonna start becoming more sympathetic towards? Like, them now, possibly? I don't know. Like, I'm, I'm not really sure. a is kind of like that one character I'm uncertain about. Like, he he has potential to be, like, a, a good person, but he's got, like, a, he's been a, a drug act a bit and all his other stuff. So, I don't know. Like, it's it's very interesting. And the Deep's kind of, like, very... He's now in the, in the press state. Like, he feels like he's just worthless and, like, life is just shit. So, what's, well, I'm not sure what's going to happen with him. Like, is he just going to be, like... Is he done? Like, he's not part of the seven anymore. I guess I'm not. I'm not entirely really sure. Cause I know, like, I know there's not a, not a new super character they introduced in season two. Cause I've seen like images of her, and I literally right as cause like it started auto playing episode two, and I paused it right on the Amazon logo. I saw the image with like the new character. So, do they replace her, or is she, or is she the replacement of Translucent now? I don't know. It's, I'm really confused. So. Man, this is like, I don't know, like, we're if, like, going to scene two, we're definitely going to learn more about this whole thing with Rebecca and the kid now, but also there's now stuff like, we're going to have to definitely see more Mallory flashbacks with like, Billy and M.M. and Frenchie, and, man, I, I don't know, this is kind of crazy, so, because now, like, cause now Huey and them, they're all on the run and stuff, Starlight is helping them on the down low. Maybe A Train's gonna be helping too. I don't know. It's very confusing. It's confusing. Ah, jeez. But yeah, I saw like I'm just kind of just scrolling through Twitter one time. And I saw a photo of Jean Carlo Esposito sitting with Carl Urban, and like I I didn't I scrolled past it. Cause I didn't want to read it in case it maybe was a thing from the show. It, it wasn't like so, but apparently it was. So Jean Carlo's in the show and he's Edgar. So I guess so now Madeline's dead, which I guess means Edgar's now gonna take that position of. Malin's role in the show, probably. Uh, that's that's interesting. Yeah, Malin is from like as somewhat middle on middle point in the show. I start realizing, no, nah, she's not. She's not making it out of the season alive. There's no way she survives. I just don't see it. What else? What, else, what happened to her kid? Like, what did? Is that is that baby dead? I don't know. It's ah man, this is really interesting. The whole Homeland Rolls definitely killed that doctor. He's dead. Uh, man, I don't know. This is great. Also, that was a great season finale. A lot of stuff happened. It was really, it was really good. Uh, 
man, this, this is quite like, good. Yeah, and Starlight's mom is a dick. Like, she just, like, she didn't care at all for, like, about She just wanted what she wanted, honestly. Like, she made it sound like, no, I did what's best for you. No, you did it, like, for her. Like, don't be, don't be trying to play off on that. Uh, Black Noir plays piano, so that's nice. He appreciates the fine arts that way, I guess, playing the piano. Are we going to learn more about him at all next season? Because, like, maybe there's going to be... Is he just going to be that, that one character in the Seven who, like, just... He's just there, like, kind of... Like, who, who, he's just kind of there only for comedic purposes. Because, like, in one episode, Starlight comes up to him and says, oh, We haven't met yet. I'm Starlight. Looks at her, like, just stares at her and just walks away. Like, like is he just there for, like, the comedic bits and also, like, action stuff, I guess? I, I don't know. Like, are we going to learn more about him? I'm not sure. But, yeah. Overall, like, this... The whole first season of The Boys was really awesome. Like, of course, it started off... First episode was, like, it was good, but it didn't, like, hook me straight away. By episode two, I was like, okay, now I'm starting... It's starting to get good. I'm interested in what's happening. By episode three on, where I'm like, okay, I'm in. I'm hooked. This is a really... It's a really good show. It's like, this is a great show. It's probably... Pro I think it's probably one of my current top ten favorite shows, probably. Like, definitely, this is, like, really good. Like, I, I love all the characters. I mean, like... Like, I mean, there's a lot of characters who are dicks, like the, like the Deep, I'm still not, I still don't give a shit about the Deep, I don't care how much sympathy they try to give him, like, he's an ass, like, for, like, because he, like, raped Star, like, Starlight's, like, no, I don't care about him, whatever, uh, but yeah, uh, uh, but yeah, I love all the characters, they're all interesting, the Wasp, I love, like, love Billy, love Huey, Starlight, Frenchie, MM, um, A-Train's quite interesting, Queen Maeve, even Hol Holmander's an ass, like, he's a, a bad dude, like, for what he's done, but there's... It's, it's, like he's, it's still interesting to watch, like, see what happens with that character. It's interesting to see what goes down. Like, he's, he's, he's an interesting, like, villain to kind of watch. So, I mean, I wouldn't say he's a straight-up villain, but, like, no, no, he is. What am I talking about? Let's, what, yeah, uh, man, I wonder what's going to happen with Homelander next, like, what, what else can he do next season that's even, like, he's going to definitely do some, like, I don't know what's going to happen next season, because now they're in the military, and, man, like, he's going to, I just... This girl probably gonna do some crazy shit next season. Jeez, oh man, but yeah, definitely one of my favorite shows right now. Like everything is just really great and interesting to watch. Uh, so uh, yeah, it was cool. It was cool. I liked also seeing Jim Beaver from Supernatural. It was like like I said, Eric Kripke made the show, made Supernatural, and made he's made this show. So that's nice seeing. One, he brought one of the actors over from Supernatural. I think also A Train's brother, if I recall, he played a character on the show also. Oh, uh, I don't want to spoil, spoil anything in case some of you watch Supernatural, but I, I'm pretty sure his A-Trans brother was a character on the show also. I know also for Season 3, like, Jens Knackles, who was one of the main people on Supernatural, he was Dean, he's going to be playing a character in Season 3 called Soldier Boy, so I'm, I'm very curious to see, like, what Soldier Boy is like. Uh, but yeah. Uh, so yeah, thank you for watching my reaction to Season 1 of The Boys. You can expect Season 2... At some point, uh, I don't, I you don't expect like the season two reaction to start up right away. There'll, there'll probably be a, a bit of a small break in between the season one and season two reactions because this was already a bit of a big undertaking doing the season one ones because I, I did not anticipate how long these episodes were. I thought uh, they were gonna be the length of like normal TV show, like so like The Walking Dead and Supernatural, like like forty two minutes. Like those shows are like forty two minutes usually in length. So I thought that's how long these episodes were going to be. So I'm like, all right, a bit longer to work with than the Clone Wars, but, you know, still manageable. I don't anticipate they'd be a, they'd be a full hour long. The shortest one is, like, 54 minutes long, and the longest one is this was this one. It was an hour and six minutes. So I don't anticipate how long these would be. And I've been, ed I've been editing all of them, and, like, they're very, they very hard to cut down the footage to under 10 minutes. So, yeah, so I I'm definitely going to start recording my reactions to The Boys Season 2, like, very soon. But don't expect them straight away. So, yeah. But yes, um, thank you for watching. I'm very excited to, s to start season two. And tell me in the comments section down below what did you think of season one and the, se the season one finale. So yeah, thank you for watching. And I'll see you guys all later for boys se season two. That voice crack there, sorry. I'll see you guys all later for the boys season two soon at some point. So yeah, see you guys all later. Goodbye. Hey, if you like that video, guess what? YouTube put out a video just for you on the left. Or, if you want to take my advice, watch the most recent video on the right. Thanks for watching.